Hi, my name is Angela Huffman and I have a quick machine quilting tip for you. This would work on either a stand-up machine or a sit-down machine. Um, many times you have a book or a pattern of a quilting motif that you would like to put in your quilt project, but you're not sure how to get it from the book over to your quilt. There's a number of different ways that you can mark a quilt. Um, the way I'm going to show you is if perhaps you've already basted your quilt or loaded your quilt to your frame and you don't want to take it off and say take your quilt top to a light box and, and mark through anything like that. This is a quick way to do it while it's basted or loaded on your frame. So I have a pattern here that I've printed out and what I want to do is I want to transfer this over to my project. And what I'm going to use to do that is a water-soluble stabilizer. So this water-soluble stabilizer, I'm going to lay it down on my pattern and then I just take an, a fine-tipped permanent marker and I trace over that pattern on that water-soluble stabilizer. Then I'm going to take that water-soluble stabilizer, put a little spray base on the back side, some temporary spray adhesive on the back side, and then I'm going to go over to my project and I'm going to lay it down on my project and adhere it to the fabric and then stitch right through that water-soluble stabilizer. So here I've stitched right through the stabilizer. And then as I work on my project further, I can just cut away some of the excess stabilizer um, so that it stays away from the edges that I may want to, to go on and stitch um, in other ways. And then when I'm done with my project, I just soak my project in water and all of this stabilizer goes away. So then all you're left with is your stitched out design. If you would like to learn more ways, more tips to increase your uh, free motion skills, I would love to have you join me in my upcoming class. We go through a lot of different ideas, a lot of different projects. I think you're gonna really enjoy growing your free motion skills with me and I'd love to see you in my classroom.